Hey guys, coming live uh, from the hotel in downtown Denver here. Um, and I wanna talk about Garden of the Gods. So this video is gonna be really just a virtual walkthrough. I know for a fact we overlapped with the Susan B. Breadegg Trail and Palmer Trail Loop, but it was a bit snowy, so we went where we could. This isn't a whole trail guide or anything like that, but just meant to show you views of Garden of the Gods, um, especially as some of you like me, I like to look things up before you go. So I'm gonna give you just a brief little history, a little piece of why this is really cool and a must check out place if you're in Colorado Springs. And then we'll just jump into the footage and really just, again, virtual kind of showing you guys around the area. Really, really beautiful. 1859, when a surveyor named Rufus Cable first saw the towering fins of rock jutting over 300 feet into the air near Pikes Peak, he enthusiastically declared that it was a fit place for the gods to assemble. From this excited outburst came the name Garden of the Gods, by which we know this beautiful Colorado Springs Park today. And then why is Garden of the Gods so famous? Garden of the Gods is a popular natural landmark nestled at the foot of Pikes Peak on the west side of Colorado Springs. Known for its massive red rocks sticking straight out of the ground, tourists come from all over the world to wander the trails, see the wildlife, and witness the formations for themselves. I'll leave more information in the description down below. Again, really, really beautiful place. I'm really grateful for Amanda and Zach, who uh, if you guys have followed my videos, um, you've seen them, they used to be in San Diego. Uh, in Colorado now and got a chance to hang out with them. Hope you guys enjoy the video. We'll cut into the footage and I'll see you guys next week.